Hey guys, my name is Ian and this is Carbright and welcome to the series where I teach you how to build a Python Twitch bot for your Twitch channel. Guess we're just sticking with that one now. <laughs> In this episode we're doing something that I can't test, so this might be slightly wrong, however the logic should be there. Um, if anything I'm just kind of informing you that this, this should in theory be possible and if you want you can experiment with it on yourself which is why it's a separate video to the last one because I can't really test this um, which is annoying but I want to talk about it anyway just in case it is a thing um, so we are going to need another import for this so uh, we're in our react.py by the way we don't need to do anything in any of the other files I don't think um, because it's just another reaction um, from re import search uh, re is regular expressions I'm not going to talk about regular expressions in detail in this video. Uh, I will talk about the regular expression I've used, but regular expressions are an absolute bitch. <laughs> so I am not going to talk about them. Just This is basically kind of a cursed video in a weird way, but um, we'll roll with it anyway. Uh, so the general match that we want to do... Um, uh, so cheers are all text-based, and they all, they all run through the Twitch chat. So we could, in theory, read a message, read the cheers, um, and then react to them and, and get the bot to say, hi, hi thanks, that's really appreciated. Um, so we could do this, we're again using the walrus operator, um, to match its search, so we want it to look for anywhere. Raw string, just because it's easier for um, regular expressions. Cheer, and then um, any number essentially any number so uh, this is essentially so if if, if there is a, a cheer and then a number at all so any number between 0 and 9 and then this is um which should actually really be uh, that um, so it's so basically what that <sighs> this regular expressions are hard so the word cheer needs to be in it then immediately after that cheer, there needs to be uh, at least one, as denoted by this plus, number between 0 and 9, and any any of these numbers will work. Um, so cheer 5 will work, cheer 153 will work, cheer 17,276,412 will work. Um, and then we need to compare that against the message, and then if that's not none, then there is a match. Uh, so we need to thank for cheer bot using and send a match object over. This match is an object by the way. Let me scroll down to the bottom and then we have our extra function down here. Uh, def thank for thank uh, for cheer bot user match and then we will send a message uh, Thanks for the. We'll leave that empty for now. Uh, bits user. Can I? I'm just gonna copy and paste this message because the actual message itself isn't important. It's the bit that goes in those braces that we've missed so far. So in here, uh, I put match dot match. I think that's wrong. I think it's match dot group. Um, it's either match dot match. that uh, again the thousand separator and then obviously we need to get rid of the cheer so we use five of the third, uh, five across oh, fifth character onwards brain come on speak <laughs> I've recorded a lot of these in one go um, I think it's I think thinking about it now it's actually group even though I put match in my plan I think it's group um, and that will just say, so if someone cheered 100 bits, it will say, thanks for the 100 bits using the net name, that's really appreciated. Um, unfortunately, as I said at the start of this, I can't actually test that. Um, so I don't know for sure if it works. It's going to be something like, uh, if this is wrong, it's going to be something similar. Um, so I'm, I'm not, I know I'm on the right lines, but I just, it that should work. It should work. I can't see a reason why that wouldn't work. Um, but uh, yeah, if, if anyone can test that, let me know. Um, if anyone can get that tested, uh, then let me know if it works or not in the Discord. That would be super, super appreciated because I really want to get that working. And if someone does manage to test it, I'll make an addendum. 
to it at the end of the series, uh, and there'll be a card for that in the top corner. Um, so, uh, yeah, if you enjoyed the video, say hello down below. If you have any questions about it, then uh, leave it down below, or, do, or join Discord, as I've said already. Um, if you're liking the series so far, then consider subscribing and hitting the bell so you know when the next series is coming out. And the next video will be, let me just get the plan up, uh, adding command aliases and cooldowns. So we're going to be doing more advanced command stuff next time. Um, so, E. Um, so, yeah. I'll see you for that one.